the hood up on the side. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel, man. Today, we're reacting to Quando Rondo. Life goes on. We're a little late like, getting to this. Obviously, uh, Quando dropped this, I believe, same day that, uh, or the day after, like, Dirk got picked up and stuff like that. And, um, no, it was obviously perfect timing. His name was being brought up again and stuff like that. Um, about the little pop killing and all that. So he dropped the song, Life Goes On. Um, I have personally heard the song since it took us a little while to get to it, or to react to it. My dad here has not heard the song at all. And um, before we actually get into the song, I want to share you with you uh, um, an Instagram post he made shortly after, like a day or two after you know, the whole Dirk thing went down. He made an Instagram post. And um, Quando said his post... It kind of like seems it seems like he was kind of forgiving, mm -hmm. you know. He say in his post, he say, um, "We didn't get into the into this music industry to make it, um, to make it and just stay caught up in the street in the streets. We all have families and communities counting on us. It's time to leave all that behind. We already lost so much, and it's heavy on my heart to forgive anyone I had issues with in the past. It's all love from me, praying for everyone. Life goes on. Mm, that was perfect his, time for dropping that. That was his quote." That he, he posted on Instagram. Um, so, you know, Quando has talked about, you know, moving on and being a better man and stuff like that. You know, he finds some little jail case of his own. He might have to go do a couple of years or something. He find really? that. I would think we talked about that his last reaction. Um, a couple, like last song he dropped. And um, he he finds some himself, you know, some from back in Savannah or whatever. And um, he was just telling, I think I told he told the judge, you know, I'm changed and I ain't the same man and all that. He really getting to his religion. You know, he Muslim too, just like Dirk and stuff. And um, so, you know, it seemed like Quando really is, you know, turning that, turning that corner. And, um, you know, that's good to see. It's kind of, it's very, very ironic with what's going on right now. Let's get into this new song though. And real quick, I'm glad to see this from Quando, man. Um, Cause I always thought he was an incredible artist. Now that we didn't got the, uh, the the rumor that Dirk actually did get on black blackballed and stuff like that off Apple Music and all that stuff. Um, hopefully, I hope that he can continue start doing like some the numbers he deserved to do, bro. Cause bro is a hell of an artist, and um, it's crazy enough, man. Out of this whole situation, who came out and um, last man standing. Here, Quando was the one that also was just minding his business the whole time. Very true. He was minding his business. He didn't start nothing when when the the night Vaughn died. Um, it's just he was minding his business. All this got started off of one simple impulse decision King Vaughn made. Like as much as we love King Vaughn, a lot of people uh, wanted to crucify Quando and all this stuff because how much they love King Vaughn. Which I've been saying this from the very beginning when our fans started picking sides, like y'all knew these people. This man, this man, um, King Vaughn made an impulse decision that night that could possibly change so many people's lives now, even four years later, with Dirk and them finally getting picked up for trying to get that get back and stuff. Like, it's crazy when you put it all together. One impulse decision. Life goes on whether you dead or in prison. Mm. Now, is this about his cousin? Yeah, pretty Tell much. Me. Basically. Okay. Let's start over. It's been a couple of years. You lost a homie, then I know how you feel. Feel like the rain coming down every time I drop tears. This shit for real, not for once. Don't you think that it isn't because when you dead in prison, that I miss you. I just wish that you ain't live by the pistol. But you forever my little hitter. I just wish you got big. RP Paul, my nigga really died for the guap. RP Rob, he died a couple streets down from the block. I swear this shit ain't never stopped for a Damn, he really died for the guap. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. 
But I think I think he had this song made already because he you know he dropped it so suddenly I'm pretty sure he didn't just go shoot the video. So uh, I might. think he just it was just, just perfect timing. Just timing. Yeah, it just worked Sometimes out perfectly. It's just timing, you know. Just worked out. I'm Scott from all the losses in the streets. I never thought I'd see your name next to RP. I thought it lately it been hard for me to fall asleep. It got me wondering, is it really a God heaven for a G? Life goes on, me and a few, but the last ones left. Life goes on, beefing with the same color on my skin, same color to hell. Young niggas right here beefing about the color of a bandana. That's why I put my flag down and I picked up a Quran because. Mm. Put his flag down, picked up a Quran. Yeah, Quran. Quran, yeah. And he did say when this when this all went he down. Said, he said people beefing over a banner, which is a headband that you know the yeah. wearing. You know, so beef beefing over a color of a banner. So he put that put his flag down, picked up the Quran. So that's true, man. People do beef over you know where you got red. And when I was growing up, you know, I never forget, man. Short story. I was in the city, man. I ain't gonna go go into the colors and stuff. But bottom line is, I was in the city, went to go see this chick. I was 16 years old, and um, I was who I was, and I was sitting on her porch with the colors I had on, and I swear she came outside, she sat next to me, and she said, you know, you don't want to be over here wearing those colors, you know, I mean, think about that, just because of the colors I had on, she's telling me I don't want to be over here wearing those colors, so obviously it was a different you know, um, fraction of a gang mm -hmm. that was over here that didn't wear these colors. So by wearing the colors I'm wearing and someone drive by, I could be putting myself in a situation. Yeah. You know what I mean? But that's crazy. Yeah, this is crazy, crazy how people look at stuff, man, you know, to identify who the other person was. Now, this was way back in the day. But bottom line is I'll never forget that. You know, and that's what he's talking about, putting the, 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 the colors down, basically. Yeah, that's great. Life goes on. That's cool. He said, sitting in my thoughts, wishing heaven had a phone. Yeah. In other words, man, I'd love to pick the phone up and call. Wishing I ever had a phone, cause I'm scarred from all the losses in the streets. I never thought I'd see your name next to RP. I thought it lately it been hard for me to fall asleep. It got me wondering, is it really a God heaven for a G? goes on. Me and a few, but the last ones left. Life goes on. Man, that's tough, Quando. Quando boy, he didn't put something out there, man. Talking about life goes on. You know, does heaven have it? Um, does, he want to know if um, what he say? Does heaven really? Is heaven really for a G or something yeah. like that? Yeah. Is there really a heaven for a G? Is there really a heaven for a G? You know, um, touching man. This 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 was touching man. You know, this is definitely. You know, he says it's been two years in the beginning, so this is definitely everything that we've been talking about with his cousin and then the time of him dropping this after Dirk just got arrested for conspiracy, you know, allegedly, you know, um, putting that together. Yeah. You know, so um, I don't want to call it a coincidence, man, but God's the one that has the power, man. This was already planned for him to have this together. So it just happens, man. Yeah, facts, man. Um, I love the direction Quando going in, man. Um, 
If y'all want to see more Kwando <laughs> reactions on the channel, y'all let me know in the comments. I think um, if y'all want to see maybe us react to that Recovery album, I think that would be a great album for Pops to listen to. That was the last album he dropped. Um, you know, we did the last little EP, the little five songs he dropped. So yeah. if y'all want to see us react to Recovery, let me know in the comments. I think that would be great. If you enjoyed this content, go check out some of our other videos. Stay blessed. Gang, we out. I'm going hard doing all this without them. Niggas be hating, I know they be sour. Forever working, we punch the clock. Close to the high, gotta go see the doc. I'm doing nothing, they be rising the stock. Banana clips be attached to the Glock. Tap of a button, loosen your top. How you get in, boy?